but it's a lot harder to get a head of thing. Okay, so as some of you may know, uh, we lost Hive A this year. Uh, they're dead, dead, dead ski. So uh, we're just going to take off the Bee Cozy, wrap them in plastic until we have enough time and uh, available space to, um, to dispose of the hive and to treat it and everything else. So, Teresa just took the top layers off. She did check inside and they were definitely yeah, most see, definitely this is what I saw. dead. Yeah, this is this is that's funny. Yeah. Well actually it's bee crap, but it's moldy bee crap. So this is the interior of our problem child hive. Hive A. There's no Yeah. No, even the one, not. even the ones that look alive are most definitely yeah. dead. And based on the amount that they've eaten, they probably died during our last minus 50 cold snap. And it's minus 50 Celsius, so I don't even want to guess what it is in Fahrenheit. A lot. It's a lot. So we're just going to bag them up so that when uh, these other guys get moving, they don't rub. Box with one bag. Yeah. If I can get the bag open. Unfortunately, all we'll be able to salvage out of this is the wax. Yeah, it it weighs about I'd say 25 pounds, um, and it weighed close to 80 going into winter, so they died relatively. Recently. And now this is layer two. Layer two. There's a big pile of dead bees. They didn't starve. They were active. This uh, dust indicates that they were eating quite frequently and enjoying themselves. And then kerpui. So let's just see if I can... going on here. Yeah, no, they completely, completely consumed their resources. And, uh, oh, they still had larvae. They had larvae, the pros on the main level. It's kind of sad. All beautiful, creamy white larvae. Lower level is fine This is the bottom board. Bottom board. So. Well, we can put them outside of the tent so the weasel can get them. Oh, is that fine? Is that up here? Oh, okay. flip it over there. You just said I'm going to put them over there. No, I'm going to put these guys over there oh, in the corner. Yeah. So that the bees have a bit of a 
face. Well, this, this this won't keep. keep up. It's it's in case you wonder why I'm moving so slowly. It's really icy around here. There's like a lot of big ice nubs and hard packed snow and hard packed snow. Double bagging. That has to be clean, so I thought I'd take that back. I think it's light enough to clean. But, I slept. Oh, okay. Did you check high one? Do you want me to double bag them? We'll put a double and we'll put another bag over them because that one uh it tore wide open at the bottom. So we meaning me No, I just need another bag and we will do it together. But you had possession of the bag, so And now, the hive that we love, the hive that was born under the worst conditions ever, well, ever for us. Sugar? Yeah. Ah. Just extra sugar that they had eaten, and I gave them the sugar, so. Okay. Oh, yeah, we want to take, we want to take the liners off. We just want to We'll just do that today. Yeah, because yeah, they got mold, too. here. So we have, there it is. We have beezes. We have many, 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 many beezes. That is a good thing. That is a very, very, very good thing. So, one, one live hive. Uh, 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 uh. And hopefully this will dry out now that they're now that their uh, hyper insulating cover is gone. The reason we're removing the hyper insulating cover is because it is going to be in the plus digits uh, all next week, getting very, very warm very, very quickly, as is the way it goes around here. And um, we don't want to suffocate them. So, on to the next hive. I'm giving high wonderland there precious brick all right hive two yep. okay all 
right. Got a little ice on the edge. It's very quiet in Hive 2. During the winter equivalent of gloving up. This is the up. one that Ed looked at yet last time and I couldn't remember if I saw any moving bees. Judging by... Yeah, I don't think so. No, nope. they, yeah. they got mold. Yeah. They got moldy. Okay. She died that one up too. We should. Alright. Okay, you know what? We'll just leave it here. It's... It's... It is what it is. Okay, that's one we can walk around here. Falling over. Bricks up, hives dead. All right. Now, my arch nemesis, Saskatchewan's one. That still had some moisture on it, so. Successful one may have bit the big one as well. Yep. Yep. No These sign. These ones probably just froze to death. There's no sign of real. They were a very small yeah. collection. Okay. So far, that's three dead. And one very much alive. So Saska tries two. Oh, yeah, it's it, this one's alive. It's producing. Copious amounts of peach. Yep. Let's just take the... This is going to get air through the holes. Let's just take this thing off. Okay. Because this is that humidity she's building up the inside of. Yeah, and now yes, And this is all crappy anyway, so... Okay. Well, we have a, that other one there. That's new. We okay. can use that one. So, yep. Boiling with peas. All alive, happy little bees. Anyway. Yeah, I'm not lifting that one. <laughs> but we will use that to repopulate our Saskatchewan's line this year. So, yay. Happy block. All right. This is either high four or five. That's four. I think it's four. Yeah. It also is rip roaring and alive. Yeah, I can take, tell because there's there's humidity. Yeah, let's take that off because. Uh, and they're fanning themselves like crazy to yeah, cool down. Yeah. So yeah, but let's help them. Well, let's just uh, air them out a little. Okay, so high four is very much alive. From them. Oh. Take ourselves out later. All right now, I'm walking on about 12 inches of ice that's melting under, and now I'm getting shorter. All right, three to check. This one's alive, sopping wet. And chewing through all their dry food. Uh, yeah. There's a little bit of mold inside the hive, or actually outside the hive. It's the pollen that molds. Huh. Good to know. 
All right. Hear yes, those. you're you're upset. I understand. I'll just tuck you ladies away. You do you do lovely work. Okay. Another living hive. So we have one, two, three, four alive so far. Which is more than we started with last year. Oh. No, it's it's moldy on top. I was just gonna reach it's, for it. It's still hot too. Yeah. So there. Oh yeah. Ooh, this one. Uh, it's, it's just the liner was removed. Whoops. Bees are being, but that's what the. Take the uh, here. Look at the um, the one from five two or five eight over there. swap out the entire board, but this one's full of bees. All right, one, two, three. Catch him. <laughs> so yesterday, or last week, Teresa and Ed came by and they gave them some sugar and uh, some pollen. Uh, they'll actually start flying for pollen this week, um, but we wanted to kind of give them a little bit of a on your market set go. And uh, these guys have uh, have consumed all the pollen, and uh, sorry, sorry viewers. There we go. Can you see it in the hmm? screen? Yeah, now we can. All right. So that's hive three. Yeah, this is I hive three. Threw some sugar in there. Yeah. So we lost. So so far the uh, the hutterite bees are doing great. Mm-hmm. We've only lost one. Two. No. No. That's, That's two. Yeah, we lost one, one set we, of We lost two. How to write these two. Yeah. So now we have one left. This is hive one. Oh, wow. So many dead bees here. That's from hive I, eight. Hive eight, yeah. yeah. All right. This is hive two. Hive one. Hive one. Is it? Pretty sure. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Dead. Okay. So we have five live. It's it's dead, but nothing with nothing uh, in particular. You know, it wrong also with seems it. yeah, but it seems to be that maybe that corner got too hot and then cold. Yeah. So the next year, well, we've discussed what we're doing next year. Yeah, we're leaving them. In I'm place. going to rip the uh, cover off this can. Maybe take, take this out. Right, no, I'm just trying to get stuck on me. There we go. Okay. This is where it can dry out. And uh, it won't continue to get overheated and there won't be any mold. So, in total, four dead, five alive. We can rebuild them. We can rebuild them, and I've ordered uh, the outfit.